Eyelashes, eyelashes, eyelashes. You guys know I'm a big fan of false eyelashes, but what is the best way to clean, store them, and reuse them? Well, in today's video, I'll be showing you guys my tips and tricks on how to do all that. Clean, store, reuse so that we can use them over and over and over again. For those of you guys who are new to my channel, welcome. My name is Jen, and what we do here on my channel is we share tips, tricks, and hacks on everything related to skincare, beauty, lifestyle, and health. So if those topics are of interest to you, be sure to click on the subscribe button right over here so we can hang out every single week. You guys can find me on Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. I'm on there every single day, so if you want to see more, you know where to find me. All right, let's get started. I'm going to show you guys my tips and tricks on how to store, clean, and reuse false eyelashes so that we don't throw them out after every single use because if you're doing that, I'm going to be saving you some money. So let's get started. Let's get to the video. If you love false eyelashes like I do, then you'll want to know my tips and tricks on how to reuse them over and over again. Now whenever it comes to false eyelashes, you always want to opt for an oil-free makeup remover. Here I'm using the Neostratus Detoxify Micellar Gel that I use to take off my makeup regularly. It's in a gel form, so it keeps the mess to a minimum. Then using a Q-tip, I'm just going to gently remove the glue from the band. I try to steer clear from the lashes, and a great tip for this is to try not to use mascara on your lashes. You guys have seen my tutorials, and I rarely ever apply mascara on top of the false lashes. This makes it easier to clean, and I always find that my lashes last way longer. Less product equals easier to clean up. Now I'm going to flip it over and clean the other side as well. Another great tip I have to share with you guys is not using dark eyelash glue. I know, but I recently switched to the House of Lashes eyelash glue and it's white but goes on clear which makes the lashes look way cleaner and not only that, it peels right off. The best way that I've found to get every piece of glue off is by using a tweezer or my fingers. It provides just the right amount of precision and all the clumps will easily come off. I don't know if you guys feel the same way, but whenever I peel off the glue, it's like the most satisfying feeling ever. Do you guys agree? If you do, comment below. After that's all done, I'll run a clean Q-tip again with some makeup remover on it and clean it one more time just to get off any extra bits. And then I'm gonna do the same on the other lash. Now remember to always store your lashes in its original box or one that has a curve to place them in. This keeps their original shape and it'll be like a fresh new pair of false lashes. Now if you find that your lashes are a little damp from the makeup remover, grab your hair dryer and set it to low and dry them just a bit. You can always go over the lashes with a spoolie or comb to make sure your lashes are perfect. Perfect. So those are my steps on how to clean, store, and reuse your eyelashes over and over again. I hope you guys found this video helpful and if you did, be sure to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and comment below and let me know if you have any extra or additional tips for false eyelashes and how to store them, clean them, and reuse them. Thank you guys so so much for watching and I'll see you very soon in the next video. Bye! Now that you guys are here, if you missed any of my recent videos, here they are. Which ones do you guys want to watch? Just click it now.